Hi, this is Kristen Garlitz with APS EdTech, and this is a video for students on how to take your items and documents and photos saved to your Chromebook in your downloads folder and upload them to your Google Drive so that if you get a new Chromebook, they'll be saved. So students, some things to think about as you are going to hand back your Chromebook at the end of the year is making sure that everything that you want to save is taken off of the Chromebook. Fortunately, anything that you have downloaded from the internet, so if I go to Chrome, do a Google search, if I right click, click Save Image, it's been downloaded to my Chromebook. It's also been copied over to my Google Drive. That way, I don't ever have to worry about the pictures and things that I've downloaded from the internet getting lost. What's going to be important for you to do is to go into your files, save any of your pictures or images that you've taken with your Chromebook camera. Click the launcher and the up arrow to get to your files. You can also right click and then pin it to the shelf so that it's always down here at the bottom. Or I can go straight to the camera and find just my pictures. So these are the images that I want to save to my Google Drive. These are the only things that are not going to be saved automatically to my Google Drive. First, though, I want to get organized. I'm going to go back to my Google Drive. And now I want to create a folder to save them in. So click New, Folder. Then give your folder a title of something you're going to remember. I'm going to call mine Pictures from my Chromebook so that it is easy to find them later. Click Create. Now I've got that folder here. I'm going to close this, go back to my files. I'm going to click and drag over all five of these pictures to highlight all five of them. Next to my Google Drive down at the bottom here, I'm going to right uh, click the little arrow, then click the little arrow next to my drive, then scroll down to find the folder pictures from my Chromebook. Now all I need to do is click and drag. and it's going to automatically make a copy of all five of those to my Chromebook. So now these pictures and videos live on the Chromebook, but they also live in my drive. So now my computer is ready to give back to the school for the summer. Thanks, and hopefully you've got your Chromebook set up so that it is more efficient for you in the future.